Hi there, my name's Amy from Email Signature Rescue and today I'm going to walk you through how to set up a HTML email signature in Outlook 2013 using the advanced method. So what we're going to do is we're going to start by opening Outlook 2013 and we'll go to File, Options, Mail and click on Signatures. Okay, now we're going to create a new signature. I'll call it Alyssa, press OK, and then we'll just assign that signature to new messaging and to replies and forwards. Now if we're installing a signature using the easy method, this is where we would just um, copy and paste the signature into, but we're going to use the advanced method today and I'm going to show you through that because um, sometimes when you use uh, the easy method, the uh, images don't come out looking uh, nice and crisp, they come out a little bit um, uh, fuzzy or unclear and um, they also show up as attachments in Mac software, so uh, things like Apple Mail or Sparrow, um, they will show up as attachments. So the, the reason for that is that um, if you use the easy method and you just copy and paste your signature directly into this box here. Um, Outlook actually generates its own signature from the signature that you've pasted in and it will also generate images as well um, and those images are actually saved and, and sent differently to how they actually should be sent using a HTML email signature. So what we're going to do today is we're actually going to override um, the way that Outlook would actually create the signature and instead we're just going to alter the, the file um, the signature file that Outlook would create. So let's just click OK. So we haven't pasted the signature in, that's fine. And then we're going to go to, um, we're actually going to hold down Control and we're going to click back onto that signatures button again once we hold down Control. Okay, and now what we've done is we've actually opened up the location of where all the um, files are stored that uh, Outlook has created for your signature. So what we want to deal with is the alyssa.htm file, okay? So we're going to right click, open with notepad, and then we're going to control A. So we're going to hold control and press A. And what that's going to do is select all of that text, and then we're going to delete all of that text. And now we're going to head over to where we downloaded our email signature um, HTML file from Email Signature Rescue and we're going to do the same so we're going to open with Notepad okay and now we're going to do the control A and that selects <coughs> all of that code and then we're going to control C to copy it and then we're going to head back to the alyssa.htm file that is uh, open in Notepad which we deleted all the HTML for, and we're going to control V into that um, alyssa.htm file, and then we're going to go File, Save, and that's going to save uh, over what Outlook what would would have generated for your signature. Okay, so now when we head back to Outlook, we we'll close this, and we're just going to hit New Email. And there it is. Okay. Now you might notice that um, the icons are a little bit cut off in uh, Outlook 2013. That is okay. It just seems to be on the Compose um, view. It doesn't actually show like that once you've sent uh, the email. So you can send yourself a test email and you'll see that uh, the icons will show perfectly.